29. Oh, Duke Kaboom. He's my favorite. They showed I him. love him. They showed <laughs> him out with um, a Duke Kaboom with, with his motorcycle. Oh, Duke you know Duke. what? As a Oh, that's a good one. Just like... <laughs> it's Toopy Toys. Hey guys, it's Tiffany from Tubi Toys with my awesome assistant. I'm Tubi. He's hello, I'm Tubi. How I'm Tubi. We are super excited to show you our Toy Story 4 Funko Pop collection. I don't know if we're going to be getting any more. There are a lot of different variations with different characters like Flocked Ducky, Flocked Bunny, um, Bo with um, somebody else, uh, uh, Woody holding Forky, and this and that and the other thing. I honestly cannot afford to buy any more. I think we have enough. We have 13 to show you. Before I begin, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Please subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. We're trying to get to 25K before Toy Story 4 comes out. Please, guys, help us out. We have a huge giveaway, and we want you to be a part of it. So please subscribe, like our videos, comment, and everything else. Let's get started. We have two um, exclusive ones. Yes, we do. One, so one from um, um, Amazon and one from... Um, GameStop. Excellent. You are so correct. We're going to start in order with number 522. This is Woody, of course. This is everybody that you can collect, which is just regular in-store Funko Pops. This does not include exclusives. So we have from numbers 522 to 536 with some missing ones along the way. I already showed you our Toy Store collection before. So this is the additional ones. Whoa, okay, let's get Woody out. Yeah, and he's, he's holding his lasso. Yes, and he doesn't have a stand this time, which is really cool. Let's see if he stands up on his own. He does. Oh my gosh, it's amazing, he does stand up. Let's take a closer look at him. Like Marcello said, he is holding his lasso, and he is holding it ready to lasso up some grub, or maybe lasso up a bad guy. Maybe it's evil Dr. Porkchop. So we have the pull string back here. We have a lot of awesome details with the gun holster. We have the boot spurs. He looks so good and I love his sheriff's badge and the fact that they put so much detail into his belt buckle. Super cool, I really, really like him. He looks really cute. Let's move on to the next one. Here is the Buzz Lightyear in his flying posing. He comes with a stand because he only has like one leg standing up. Very good, that's number 523. Uh-oh, I ripped the box. Oh, fatal error on my part. Here we go. Yes, he is on a stand. This is not the stand that's removable, so you do want to keep him on. Oh my God. Oh my God, look. It says Bonnie on the bottom. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. That is so crazy. So why it doesn't have Andy on it? What did they wipe it off with something? It was permanent marker. I know. Oh, my, I'm gonna cry. How did these get all scratched up? These have been in the box. He looks so cool. He looks like he's ready to fly with style. His wings are out, so he's ready to go psh, to infinity and beyond. Woo! I wonder, I wonder if he's gonna have Bonnie under him. Oh, I'm sure he will. Me too. This is number 524. This is Bo with little Giggle McDimple. You know what? They should have come out with Bonnie's toys. That would have been awesome. Yeah. Number 524. She has a stand also. She does. Is there a little stand for Giggle? Or can you put Giggle on her shoulder? She's so cute. Oh my goodness. Uh-oh. Lose that. Here is Bo with her crook, and she's wearing her super bow outfit. I love the detail with the lace on the bottom of her cape slash skirt. Here is little Giggle McDimple. She's so cute. So super small. Oh my gosh, she is so adorable. I love the detail on her. Let's put Bo on her stand. Looking good, Bo. I don't think old Mr. Giggle could go on her shoulder. Uh, I think you're right. I don't think she can. Because, but because of her big head. Yeah, right. She has a big head. But maybe she could stand in front of her? Let's yeah, try she, it out. Yeah, she can definitely stand on the stand. No. Just lean her up on Bo. I will. <laughs> I can't. She's too heavy. Oh, no. All right, lay her down. She's tired. Go to sleep. All right, let's move on. Moving on to 525 is Alien, and he's eternally grateful, and we are eternally grateful to have him. I love Alien. Who else loves Alien? Ooh. <laughs> Alien's my favorite. He really is. 
There's and I'm so happy to have him. There's another Funko Pop of Alien the, that's like the same one as this one. It's yeah. Old, it's like an old Funko Pop. Ooh, look at that. He turns his head. Do the other ones turn their heads too? Oh, yeah. Wow, it does. What about Buzz? Oh, that's going to be nice when you display him on a shelf. Ooh. Oh, she kind of turns her head. You don't want to really mess with that, though. Look at Alien. He's so super cute. He is one of my favorite characters. And he was available on the Letterbox edition. Do you remember that? <laughs> Letterbox was such, like, a big deal back in the day. Like, oh, my God. Like, you got Letterbox? Like, yeah, we're going to watch this movie in Letterbox. You guys have no idea what I'm talking about. But Letterbox was such a big deal. Anyway, here's Alien. He's so cute. I love his little stance. He's adorable. We have to. I wish they made more that, like, you know, so they can all hold hands. Oh, yeah. That Maybe was... they do. Huh. Let's move on to Jessie, number 526. I love her little pose. I wasn't going to get Jessie at first. Because we already have Jessie, but I'm like, you know what? She looks so cute in this little pose that I had to get her. And I feel like Jessie's not getting enough love in Toy Story 4. I don't know why. I feel like it's all about Bo. All about Bo. Well, guess what? Bo was only there for two movies. I know so was Jessie, but Jessie has been in follow-up ones. Jessie is awesome. I love both of them, but come on. Give Jessie some love. Look at Jessie from head to toe. She looks so cool. I love her little cowgirl pose. This is one cool pop. Love that. She's so cute. Number 527 is Gabby Gabby. I'm so happy to have her as a pop because I like that she's a bigger figure. I can't wait for the 7-inch figures to come out. If you haven't already, make sure you pre-order her on Amazon. And there's going to be an antique edition, just like how they had the RV. I'm talking about the Mattel 7-inch figures. I'm not talking about Funko Pops. The antique set has Combat Carl Jr. in it. So I had to get an individual 7-inch, though. What is this, like, wetness? It's like all the glue. But she will be making appearances in our videos. She is our villain for our skits right now until we see the movie and we see what's going on. She's so cute, though. I want to dress up as her for, like, Halloween. She's so cute. Well, how can we do that for, for Halloween, for Toy Story 4? You know that's happening, for sure. And, and I'm also going to have a Toy Story 4 birthday party. You are? Yep. You should invite everybody to come. We we, uh, we we have Toy Story party favors. Yes, we do. We, we got have, a whole bunch. Yeah. Here is Forky. It's number 528. This is so cute, Forky. He has, he has the rainbow on him. Yes, he does. Oh, uh, get out. Let's oh. check under him. Oh, it does say Bonnie. <gasps> it does. It does say Bonnie. How cute. Oh, wait. Does this? We didn't even check. No. Oh, it does. It's not. Oh, yeah. Why would it say Bonnie under her? Does it say Bonnie? It doesn't say Bonnie under Jesse. What? Yeah, what is right? Doesn't say Bonnie under Alien. It doesn't say Bonnie under Bo. Interesting. So we have Forky. He is so cute. Everybody loves Forky. You know, this whole movie. Why are these so dirty? This whole movie is based on the friendships that you make with your toys and how much they mold you as you grow older in life like for me i used to collect a lot of toys and my favorite toy collections were barbie and my simpsons collection i loved all my simpsons figures by playmates i still have them if you want to see them let me know in the comments below i will take them out of storage i don't have them on display because i'm afraid my children will destroy it so I that's think, why i don't have them I, out i i think i know what i definitely know one of them it's that it's not like mcdonald's toy that you push down and it goes back up um, that's Lisa Simpson. That was from, I don't, I don't know where that was from. 29. Oh, Duke Kaboom. He's my favorite. They show I him. love him. They show him out with, um, a Duke Kaboom with, with his motorcycle. Oh, you know what? As a, oh, that's a good one. Just like they do, just like they do with the last girl. Yeah, I like that. Just like, yeah, the pop vehicles. That's a great idea, Marcello. We should tell them that. He is so cute. I love Duke Kaboom so much. He reminds me of a mixture of Speed Racer and Evil Knievel. He is the Canadian stuntman. And his um, toy company, I think, is Maple Leaf Toys, I yeah, think. Yeah, it's Maple Leaf Toys. Right, and he has the big Maple Leaf on the back. And, of course, the Maple Leaf is the insignia or, like, the logo or whatever. For Canada, we love Canada so much. I love that they included the posable areas for him because he is super posable. We have family in Canada, so I'm sure they love the fact that Canada is represented in Toy Story 4. So super cool. 
Love Dude, that. Mom, do, don't look under um, the ones that are not Bonnie's like toys. Now. Why? Be because they won't say it. Well, maybe. You never know. Maybe there's like a spoiler. Maybe oh. they did go to Bonnie. Oh, yeah. There's a lot of the books I've been ordering and I'm peeking in them. Oh, my God. I know almost the whole story already and it's bringing me to tears. There's like one little children's book that I thought was safe to read and it's totally not because it gives away a huge spoiler for the entire movie. Tell me. I'm not telling you. No way. Tell Let's me. move on to Combat Carl Jr. Combat Carl was in two Toy Story movies. Toy Story of Teller. Um, uh, and um and Toy Story One. That's, That's different right. One. Yeah, the yes, exactly. This is so cool. Look, they even have the poseable joints detail. Look how he's standing. I love Combat Carl so much. I'm so happy that he is in the new movie. Look at the details at the bottom. They even have the screws. He's so cool. What did you want to say about Combat Carl? Is that what you wanted to say? Uh, yeah, that was what I wanted to say. He is so awesome. He I'm has, so happy. He has a flat surface on his head. That's right. This is a typical, like, 80s fashion. Can I, can I feel it? Yeah. Wow. Isn't that cool? I love it. Let's move on to number 531, we Ducky. Like, we have four more to open. This is Ducky. He's so cute. He is so cute. I love his little feet. They kind of remind me of Big Bird. He's such a cute little duck. Adorable. Let's see if he stands up well, though. <gasps> he does. He's so cute. All right, let's move up to five, number 532. Oh, my gosh. Bunny. <laughs> I'm sure Bunny <gasps> understands. Oh, my God. Look. That is so cool that they included the little hang tag. I love that they did this. And look, he even has his hand out so he can connect them together because best friends are always stuck together. Isn't that so cute? They don't actually stick together, but they have their hands out so they can hold hands. That is the sweetest, sweetest, sweetest little detail. I love that. I love his colors too. <gasps> they even have the tag. That is so cute. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. They are so cute. I love his colors too. These colors are like, if I had like my own room, which I don't. <laughs> You would paint them I would paint colors? them these colors. It's so much fun with like a lot of white, what? like everything white. And then this, how cool would that look? Just, just, just put eyes in a mouth so they, and whiskers so it could be like the bunny. Yeah, good idea. I like that idea. Okay, we put them on the stand so you guys can see them better. Here is number 534. This is GameStop version of Forky and he looks so scared. We got this for $12 at our local GameStop, and he was super easy to find. I didn't want to really go chasing around fig like Pops this time around. It's just becoming too crazy, honestly. It says Bonnie also. Oh, it says Bonnie, and he's really scared. I am not a toy. Ah! Ah! So cute. That's it. That's really, there's nothing to him. He's really adorable. And comparing him to the original one, yes, his eyebrow is different. His eyebrows are different and his mouth, even his hands are the same. Everything is the same except the facial expression. And the little eyebrows. Yeah, exactly. Cute. Okay, finally is this Amazon exclusive. When I pre-ordered all of these pops on Amazon, I added this one and I'm like, you know what, why would I get this? Because it's really nothing to him, but you know what, he's really cool. I like the way he's stand, like his stances, because it looks like he's just like landing. That is really cool. And he's also on a stand. Oh, it says Bonnie, how cute. They should have made the, um, the flying one, the, the Amazon exclusive. They should have, but you know what, look, this is cool too. Do you see the incline on his feet? Oh my God, it does look like he's, he's Exactly, he's down. landing. It would be cool if he had like boosters on the bottom, but it doesn't have that. He's super awesome. Really cool. Well, guys, that's our unboxing video for all of our Toy Story 4 Funko Pops. Which ones did you get? Do you suggest that we get any of the exclusives? So, guys, let me know which one is your favorite in the comments below. I have to say Gabby Gabby and um, Duke Kaboom and Combat Carl are my three top ones. I love them. But I also love that Ducky and Bunny are holding hands. They're so cute. And all of Ducky's, like, little details, like the tag and the hang tag. So super cute. Guys, don't forget to get... Oh, wait, what was your favorite? Oh, I like all of them. Oh, I knew that. Why did I even ask? Thank you so much for watching, guys. Please don't forget to like this video if you cannot wait for Toy Story 4. Please subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. And please share our videos. We really do appreciate it. We're trying to get to 25K by June 21st. Follow us on social, Instagram, Facebook, at 2 Toys, on Twitter, at 2 underscore toys. Thanks for watching, guys. And have a great day. Subscribe. It's free. Thanks, guys. Have a great day.
Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe. Yeah, yeah, yeah.